Greetings, soul family. As you know, today, Monday, January 17th or 18th, depending on where you live in the world, is our full moon in Cancer. A personal issue reaches resolution. I like Cancer moons because, number one, it's ruled by the moon and it helps us to dig deep and really get some clarity in our lives. It slows us down and makes us take time to really look at the full situation and not just bits and pieces, but bringing all of it together and looking at it, right? So they say this is a super emotional sign, right? So there could be some explosion of feelings around now or surrounding your question, right? So you have some questions in your heart, some things you want to get off your chest, some things you want to say, but you don't know how to say it, maybe, or some things you're seeing, but you don't know how to address it, <laughs> this moon going to help you out. It's going to help you acknowledge something, adjust something, or let it go, right? That's what full moons do. They, they illuminate it by the sun, right? So they shine the light on the whole situation and give you a chance to work through it, right? To dig deep and work through it, just like the self-love oracle that I just did. So, this is a time for you to step up and agree to overcome any insecurities you have, drop into your heart space, and say what needs to be said. It says it's be it may be best to move towards what you want in a sideways manner, just like a crab, because that's how they walk sideways. They don't walk straight. They walk sideways. They tread lightly. And then they gather all the information and say what they have to say. Medi so, um, some other meanings could be meditate to soothe heightened emotions, because they are high. It's a full moon. Don't be clingy. Don't sulk, you know, say what you have to say or find a way to um, find some positive, energetic things to do until you can find a space to say what you have to say or do what you have to do, right? And spend some time with family. They always help you get back to center and help you, you know, figure out who you are and what you want to do. So, with this moon, <laughs> they're advising you, don't worry, all will soon be well. Right? So, just take the time to, you know, go within and dig deep. So, the next card I pulled was from our energy oracle. Fourth chakra, Archangel Raphael came out. And I love this because it's all about that heart energy. You know, that heart focus. Like I said, you got to drop into your heart space to, to talk and, and, and let someone or something or figure out a situation, you're going to have to drop into your heart space. You're going to have some love, some compassion, and some self-acceptance of your role in anything that you need to discuss or talk about, right? Um, you're, at this point, it's saying this card upright indicates that you are now ready to receive love from others, but especially from yourself. Your broken heart is being healed you may not know you have a broken heart and sometimes you don't know until situations arise and you're like, oh, I didn't heal that. I thought I healed that. But you see the actions in a person and it'll bring up that or, you know, it trigger that energy again. So we're all works in progress and we just need to keep working on ourselves. Be tender with ourselves. Don't talk bad to ourselves. Talk wonderful to ourselves and really love on ourselves and hug up on ourselves. Right. And the affirmation for fourth chakra archangel Raphael is my heart center my fourth chakra is open to its perfect healthy and joyful state the energy of love flows through me now I live in love I love that 3 plus 8 equals 11 so y'all know this is a wonderful energetic card look at that the feathers oh I just love everything about this card so then I went to the goddesses because, you know, they always got something to say during the full moon. <laughs> and look who came out. Lakshmi, bright future. Stop wearing. Everything is going to be fine. I love this woman. Like, I love this goddess. Everything about her, I adore. <laughs> she always give, um, uplifts us and gives us hope for a brighter tomorrow. She helps us. Um, she's optimistic, right? She gives us energy of faith, hope, and love, and optimism. And I love that. Um, she helps us to remove blocks and obstacles that we may encounter in our lives. 
She clears our heart of fear, right? We drop into our heart space and be in love, right? So everything about this full moon right now is telling us to dig deep and go within and not worry. Because whatever the outcome is, it's going to be bright. It's going to be something that we desire, something that's good for us, right? So let's let's let go of that bag. <laughs> it says let go of the bag lady fears about our future, right? <laughs> and I love that because that's one of my favorite songs. Um Hold on to your positive thoughts and intentions. Don't worry about money instead, but visualize your abundance. Visualize being in your abundance. I do that all the time. So I really don't worry about money too much. I'm busted right now, and I'm like, you know what? I'm not worried. It'll come. Because <laughs> I, I, I have great visualization skills and tapping skills. And most of all, I have vibrational frequencies that match the energy of abundance. So... You know, that's what we have to do. We have to change our mindset, clear out that fear, and move forward. Our full moon affirmation, every day I focus on what is important. Every day I focus on what is important. And when you're doing that, you don't have time to worry. <laughs> you're in your heart space. And you know that all will be well. So every day, focus on what's important. I thank you all so much. Please take time to like, especially share, and ask people to subscribe. <laughs> I really appreciate that. I would love to grow my subscribers so that I can bring more content and um, communicate, you know, a little live. I like the live communication. I love that. I love watching the people that I love doing it. So, um I'm trying to expand a little here, especially in communication since I am an air sign. So I really would appreciate the help of you liking, sharing, and subscribing. And comment. Feel free to comment. Thank you so much for watching. Take time to do what makes your soul happy. Be happy, be light, be love. Namaste.